Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. I recommend it. I ain't trying to advertise no bullshit. You gotta respect my nigga show. But I'm saying at the same time, you know what I'm saying? Life all about sacrifices. You know what I'm saying? If you do everything with pure intention shit, you know, a lot of shit gonna train. Ain't, it ain't never said it's gonna be easy here. You know Let me ask you this, man. When, when that happened, did you get a call like from Gucci? Do he call you and say, hey, man? Nah, he ain't man, call me. He say, hey, man, nah, you he, messing up. Get off the board. Nah, he ain't call me. He ain't call me. You know, when he linked, though, he probably put a little bug in my ear. Put, put <laughs> yeah. my but he know, you know what I'm saying? He signed a nigga. He gonna sign a nigga that he feel like. You know what I'm saying? He, he know gonna, what come with it. Yeah, he gonna, he know well, what come with it. He didn't did it too. And plus, you know what I'm saying? He yeah. not already voiced this opinion. Mm. You I, know what I'm saying? He I not already told me stay out of, stay trouble. Out of trouble. He already, but yeah, you know what I'm saying? I ain't his son. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. you know what I get saying? it, I get it. But I saw like in my <laughs> mind, and and it's a crazy way to think maybe. But in my mind, I'm like when when I see Gu Gucci with you guys and Pooh Shot, all these people, <laughs> anybody that he dealt with. Because of the background that he has, he's able to communicate them with them in any situation, in any way, if he choose to. Because he's been through so much. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying? But like, nigga ain't going to listen. I ain't saying nigga going to listen or nothing. Nah, it like shit. You know what I'm saying? We all grown type <laughs> shit, so... You know what I'm saying? I feel like he feel like if, if it happens, shit, it had it to happen. It happened, yeah. You know, he knows shit happens. You know, they going to try to... What's it called? They, they going to try to... They going to try to fuck over, nigga. You know the white folks gonna try to hide you. You know what I'm saying? That's just how it go. But I, I think so what made you what made you sign the Not all too? white folks though. There's just some of them. Not all white folks. Yeah, I'm mixed with white, so I ain't you racist or not like that. <laughs> yeah. My but, granddad is white. Hers too. Mine too. Yeah, that's why y'all so light skinned. <laughs> you niggas just light skinned. Not My true. granddad is straight African, nigga. He jumped off the boat, nigga. <laughs> don't like swim the rest of the way. You just no, you got some you got some light straight skin. Don't don't start. 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 I could have signed with Rockefeller too, though. That's what I'm asking you. Why 1017? Because I feel like it was just a bigger platform. It's like one of the most buzzing, buzzing labels. You know, sometimes, sometimes you're going to sign. Like, you got to see. I, I'm going to have my own regular label one day. You okay. know what I'm saying? I ain't going to be 1017 forever. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, they got to be like. They got to be like, I'm always going to be 1017, but I want my own shit too. Of course. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't know what I'm saying. I just don't want to be known for just being signed with 1017. I want some other accomplishments too. Did you, you know what I'm saying? Did you sign like did you you say you sent him a notice? So how did you how did you nah, I just wrote him. him? I just wrote him on I was like, nigga, fuck with me, nigga. You on signed Instagram? All the, yeah. And you was like, nigga, you signed all them other niggas. And I was like, you signed all them other niggas, come sign mm -hmm. a real street nigga. Mm -hmm. Man, I'm gonna tell you a story, and you gotta hear this. He dead and gone now. My partner and me, right when I I met Gucci in Vegas at the Palms, he don't even know this, but we went up there. You know, Cherry mm -hmm, Bomb, mm -hmm. Cherry Bomb, my street nigga. He always with me. We went up there, and I told a nigga, cause me and Gucci were walking out of room, and Gucci was like, I said, man, you gotta come rock with me. Yeah, I got a clothing store in Dallas. He said, cool. Yo. But 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 my nigga was at the other side. He was in the Palm Place, mm -hmm. and uh, he was like. Uh, I, I call him. I say, nigga, Gucci in here. He a big short nigga. He, he come yep. downstairs with a tank top on, had about 30 grand in his pocket. Street nigga. Yep. He said, man, that nigga got to feel me, man. Where this nigga at? He could not find him, but he died as soon as we got back. I killed him. <laughs> I was like, man, I wish he'd got to meet Gucci, man, man before man. he died. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, Paul Wow loved him because he was on that syrup up there. It messed them boys' head up the way yeah, he was that, that nigga crazy, though. That nigga ain't friendly, though. <laughs> no, no, he ain't, ain't friendly. But he ain't friendly, he ain't but once, friendly. He, once he won more tea, he gonna fuck with you, though. No, no, he ain't friendly, but at the end of the day, he a real, like, he come spoke to us. We was just yeah. walking. We was in the right spot at the right time. Nah, for sure. We was at Magic, and he was just in there gambling, man. When you own stores and you up there for business, people yeah, yeah. don't respect you on a business nah, for you real, know, for setting. Real. So that's how that went. But at the end of the day, Hey man, for you to sign the 1017 from uh, Waco, he loved Texas because Enchanting was yeah. also, she he, from he, here. Man, Gucci, fuck with Gucci got a song, Gucci got a song with Zero. Yeah, so, and, and he had a song, he done had a song with a bunch of niggas from Gucci Texas. Gucci got a song with Zero called Haters Got Me Wrong. Mm -hmm. hard. And that bitch hard. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga been fucking so, nigga, nigga been fucking with Texas niggas. He loves like Texas. Texas the reason why Texas the Texas the reason why niggas respect the South. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.